Yeah, you can uh, pop that stuff in anywhere. That's great. Take a seat. Alrighty. What are you expecting from Kayla? I expect from Kayla for her to come out with the intent to fix what's happened to her before. Like you come back from a, a, a loss, for example, you want a, a clean slate, you want to erase what happened, you want to fix it. Um, being off for a year, that's really difficult, and uh, ring rest is a thing in my personal experience. So coming back with all the expectations she clearly puts on herself, it's not going to be easy for her. My opportunities versus Kayla is I am the most well-rounded fighter she has faced. Lursa is fantastic and Lursa has excelled as the years have gone on, but her biggest attribute is she hits like a truck. Once they hit the mat, that is not a threat for Kayla whatsoever, and that's where she excels. She gets to the round, she takes a sigh of relief, and it's not going to be the case here. For you, what would a victory in this fight mean? She has the name, she has a fantastic record, and she's clearly the face of PFL. That would definitely be the biggest fight in my career, the biggest win in my career so far. Can I ask you about your uh, knowledge of American presidents? You may. Come along. That is John F. Kennedy. Yep. There's uh, Theodore Roosevelt. Abraham Lincoln. That is very impressive. That is like Ray Sefo and Joe Biden had a baby. Yep. Okay. American presidents. <laughs> all right. Oh, you got them all right. So thank That's you. well done. <laughs>about your opponent Clay Collard. You're an expert in analyzing your opponents. Where do you see your advantage here? Uh, I think I'm technically and tactically a lot better than him and I think that's the two best uh, advantage I have uh, over him. The guy is crazy though so you we do a crazy sport so anything can happen but we do a lot of mistake and I think it's gonna be a good way to uh, take, uh, take the opportunity when they do those mistakes. With that being said you do those mistakes, but if you don't take the opportunity, he make you pay, you know? Now that, uh, that the PFL has acquired Bellator, they're talking about in February having a champions versus champions kind of uh, pay-per-view. So you're done with the regular season, but would you entertain like being in a pay-per-view, a one-off? Uh, I would if it's in Montreal. Like for me, I would say that I prefer passing time with my family with my friends. To win one million, it's peace of mind. Winning two million, it's, that's it, you know. I can do whatever I want. I can uh, go work in a coffee shop. I can go work on TV. Like, I, I can do anything. Uh, I don't care. Uh, I want to sleep well. And uh, I think this year is going to be the, the year that I'm going to sleep uh, perfectly. Something that Brett Akimoto said about your opponent, OEM, is he called him the Tom Brady of MMA because he's like very cerebral fighter. What do you think of that? Well, first off, I'm a Dolphins fan, so we don't like Tom Brady. Um, I'm gonna pull some fi Fitz magic. You know what I'm saying? Last play of the game, he's bombing it down. As far as like him being able to read an opponent, I feel like he's never fought anybody with the pace like mine. I don't feel like he's fought anybody with hands like mine, accuracy like mine. So, you know, like Mike Tyson says, everybody has a plan until they get hit in the face. I hit them in the face, and I do it a lot. What's it going to mean to you to win the title? That's why we start this, right? So we can be world champions. So, I mean, that's a dream come true. Um, on top of that, I get a good payday to be able to take care of my family, and that's something I'm really striving for, so. It's gonna be nice, bro. Which one do I get, the green one? That's Women's. Light. That's light. Lightweight, that's mine. Yeah, that's yours. Yeah. Take that <laughs> home. <laughs> or take that <laughs> home. The, the hotel is amazing, it's beautiful. I love the city, it's really nice. Uh, I think I might go walk around a little bit when I'm done with the media stuff here, and I'm excited to be here. There you go. The photo shoot was great. They have a, a new sponsor, uh, Takedown. Uh, comfortable clothes, I'm excited to wear their gear. I think uh, I've improved the most just with my experience. Each time I step into the smart cage, I get more and more comfortable. I feel more at home. Yeah, I, I'm just looking to display everything that I work hard on. I'm gonna start pull it and twist it. Yeah, that's it, so it's bop it, pull it, twist it. So. Okay. Oh. You can do 
I was good though. That's the new high score. That's good. Yeah. Dude, it was getting fast. <laughs> it changed the octaves too. 74, okay. Bro. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> Talk about your opponent, Derek Brunson. I make a mess like this. Uh, I think I had the advantage over him everywhere, standing and on the ground. So I don't know. I think he thinks that he's going to take me down and bully me around. It's a big mistake that he's thinking that the fight's going to go how I want it to go. Uh, I'm going to keep it standing, and I'm planning on knocking him out. That's no, there's no secret there. I've been training my whole life. I've been through the championships. I did it multiple times. I don't think about ring rust. There's no secret around fighting. You go in there, you go and fight. That's pretty much it. For the guys that think about ring rust, they shouldn't be in this sport. You still love fighting? Oh, every day. That's the only thing that I love to do. There's nothing else that can match that. I try to do a lot of things that can match fighting, but there's nothing that can scratch that itch. And I'm just real excited to just get back there and fight. Marker. So how does Larissa feel about the opportunity to be the first ever two division champion in PFL? Vai ser uma quebra de barreira na minha vida, acho que na minha carreira profissional. Então, ser campeã de duas categorias diferentes é, vai ser um marco para mim. Eu vou conseguir marcar meu nome na história independente do que eu vou fazer depois disso acontecer, mas só de conseguir ser campeã em duas categorias vai já deixar meu nome registrado em algum lugar. How is your preparation for this fight been going? É, eu estou muito bem preparada para lutar na, 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 na parte de trocação, na parte de grappling, na parte de jiu-jitsu. Eu acho que ela vai ter um problema em todas as áreas é, que ela quiser lutar comigo, porque eu me preparei muito para isso. Have you got two belts? Then. I was going to we'll say the old belt and the new belt. We'd love to get, uh, yeah, we'd love to get some some of those shots, obviously, to yeah. spread throughout the year. Absolutely. Com certeza. Agora eu já sinto a fight week. Já já tô na energia. Já quero lutar. Já quero brigar. Já quero acabar logo com isso. Então acho que poder finalizar com chave de ouro é o cinturão, na verdade, é o que a gente busca o ano inteiro chegar agora. Eu acho que agora é é mais intenso do que todas as outras do que todas as outras lutas, tipo do que a season inteira, agora é a parte mais importante. <risos>